actually can't deal with my hair right now. Don't know if you can tell, but it's so dry. Last time it looked like hay, and now it looks like seaweed or a scarecrow. I look like a scarecrow. Anyway, hello everyone. Apart from the person that told me to delete my channel because I'm not consistent. <laughs> Weird way to say you miss me, babes. She did sound really funny and she liked my content, but I should delete my channel. How about me? Although it did make me think, I'm gonna fucking post, I'm gonna post every week now. And then I thought, wow, reverse psychology, you're smart. If you want consistency from me, just tell me to delete my channel, but also that you think I'm really funny and you like my content. I was going to take my nail varnish off for a side filming. Whoops. Okay, so this vlog's all about home updates, and I'm still in front of. Ow! <laughs> going through changes. Who remembers that song? I have like a YouTube folder in my TikTok saves of little clips. You know, I add my clips in, and I literally just save one of Ozzy Osbourne, so I think that's why it's in my head. But we are going through changes, and here they are. The glue. I absolutely love my sofa. I've only gone and sold it. Well, I've sold the sofa, but they don't want the ottoman. I've only got two more days with the sofa. R.I.P. So it's being collected on Sunday, and then I'm going to put on screen my new sofa. Here it is. What do you think? How different is it? Like, this one is light and cream, and this one is green. Like, we're going for a screen, but how good is this gold lamp going to look up against a green sofa? Gold and green is just going to look so good. And you might be wondering, but Jess, why are you getting rid of a sofa that you love? Well, I'm no longer a lone ranger in this flat. To be fair, I haven't been for a long while. But, like, properly, officially, my boyfriend's moving in, even though he's pretty much been moved in since, like, day two. But that's a whole other story. Anyway, what was my point? So yeah, basically he's moving in and we need a sofa bed. Just to confirm, the sofa bed isn't for him to sleep on. It does sound like that, doesn't it? It's not. Okay, back to the video. This new sofa is a sofa bed. My fave sofa forever's gotta go. I'm sad about it, but I'm actually so excited for the new sofa. The new sofa's due to come in like three weeks today. Do you actually need your help? Because as you can see, there's pink in the room. Oh my God, look, I'm using my sweaty bollocks candle. <laughs> I've got no candles left, so I had to use the sweaty bollocks one. Great Christmas present. Can we actually talk about Christmas, though? It's next month. So, yeah, obviously, I've got pink there. And then on here is pink. Pink. Obviously, I can just put this in another room. But I want to change these flowers. Now, what colour would you do with the green? We're thinking orange. Like an orange sort of colour. I did see some in the range. So, comment below what colour. Because, obviously, as well, like... We've got no cushions for the new sofa. So I need to know what I'm doing. I'm thinking orange, burnt orange. Or do I just stick with like this or white? Mm, it's a bit boring though, isn't it? I don't know, let me know. Closer it gets to the new sofa coming, it's just giving me this urge to change things and just do home stuff. I don't like the idea of someone moving in with me and then it's just like all about me. I mean, life does revolve around me. But they're moving in, like I want it to be like their home. So I'd like to make changes together to get var. Um, but it's just spurred me on to be like, what else can we do? I was actually sat there the other night going, what else can we do? What should we, what should we do? And, oh my god, there's so much, I've got so much to say, I'm like, blah, 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 word vomit. I always am. Okay, so, change number whatever. As you can see up here on my curtain pole, look at the state of it. Oh my god, look at the cobwebs, exposing myself. My organised dust pit. Look, so, this was a silver pole, as you can see, that I sprayed white. It looks like absolute crap. So I want to keep my curtains, but I need to change the pole. What colour too, though? I mean, the obvious answer is gold, but try and find me a gold pole, please. Actually hard. I was thinking maybe like this colour. And I thought that was black, but it's actually not black. What colour is this? And then round here, yes, that's my vintage stuff that I've still not listed. I'm actually the worst person ever. Someone actually messaged me on vintage and said, still nothing. And I was like, I oh, know, I'm so bad. I have every intention of doing it. That's why it's sat there looking so ugly. Every single day I look at that pile and know I should be doing something about it. I just randomly was talking and thought, wow, you look ugly. Self-love. <laughs> and here you see a ladder. This isn't just any ladder, ladies and gentlemen. This is a loft ladder. My loft that, again, like, what? Why is it so scratched? That needs to be painted. I've got a loft, people, if you didn't know. And I've never, ever put a single thing up there. And that is about to change. Because I'm finally going to have a tumble dryer. And I cannot wait. I'm sick of putting the heating on for no reason at all. Just to dry something. Because otherwise it gets that horrible dog smell. You know that a wet dog smell when something's taking ages to dry? In this 2022, we can't be putting the heating on for no reason. The tumble dryer is going in my little outhouse. Which someone Australian said an outhouse is an outside toilet. In Australia, it's not a toilet. For me, I don't know why I call it an outhouse. 
But you've seen it before, I've organised it, and we will be organising it again. It needs a good sort in, which I'm gonna do on YouTube as well. We're gonna sort it together. Together, that's stuck in my head. This is where the loft ladder comes in. So we're gonna board out the loft. Wish I can film a few bits, the process. And I've gotta put some stuff, like Christmas bits again, Christmas. I'm itching to talk about Christmas. Oh, Christmas stuff up there and bits like that. Although there's currently a bird up there. I never lived on my own, I live with a bird. I said a bird, bird, bird is the word, bird, bird, bird. Somehow we need to get the bird out. Birds love it here. I think I'm Mary Poppins. Who remembers my Instagram stories? If you don't follow me on Instagram, then why not? I post sporadically like I do on here. Although I used to post every single day without fail. I had three birds, little teeny birds, it was so cute, that just made their way into my little vent in my kitchen. I wondered what that was then, look, it's my hand, I was like, if it was a bird, I said a bird, bird, bird is a word. They were in my kitchen thing and they were so small and cute and I had to get them out and I had to save them, but this one's a bigger bird. Where was I going with this? We've got to organise that, put that up there, fit the tumble dryer in. The cupboard is on the other side of this wall. Some electric stuff has to happen and then it needs to go out there because in my kitchen, there's just no room for a, don't look at my washing up, there's no room. I did consider putting it in this cupboard which is Henry's room. Hey Henry! But Henry's there, do you know what I mean? No, I'm not gonna give I'm not gonna give your room away. God, don't look at me like that, Henry. I hate Henry though. Like he's a good hoover, but I absolutely hate him. Such a drama queen, can't deal with his shit. Next home update. I need your honest opinion. You can abuse me in the comments. Don't tell me to delete my channel. Cause I will. Not. I'm sorry if you're a live laugh love home or a live laugh love kind of girl. Home is where the heart is, um, <laughs> your laughter is in the house, I don't know. Do you know all them signs? Basically, I'm not a live, laugh, love home. However, <laughs> we wanted to put some photos up in this flat, okay? I've literally never had photos up in here, and it's always on my New Year's resolution, but now we're going to get photos, and we're going to put them, to start with, <laughs> on this wall. So I wanted like a little collage. Collage is screaming live, laugh, love already, I know. Wait, you wait for it. Blank space, it's perfect, ignore the socks. They are actually been washed. We're in the range and we see this collage photo frame. We're both like, well, yeah, we like this, yeah, cute, cute. This is gonna be our first photos. You're moving in, cute, love that. Take out and we both wanna get it up. And then I start telling Naomi, fucking bitch, about this photo frame. She's like, collage. <laughs> Do you want to send me a photo of this uh, photo frame? And I'm like, oh no. I start looking and I'm like, I think it's giving live, laugh, love vibes. I sent her a photo and then I noticed that on this photo frame it says happiness. What does it say? I'll show you in a minute. Happiness blooms from within. And I'm like, oh my God, that should have been my clear sign that that is destined for a live, laugh, love home and not mine. That was it, we couldn't stop laughing. She was like, Jess, what the hell? <laughs> and I was like, because I still kind of like it, but now I can't unsee live laugh love and then she sent me <laughs> and then she said again don't take offense if you've got any of these items all right we've all got different opinions you might hate my sofa and that's fine it's a beautiful sofa in my opinion um anyway she said now i know what to get you for christmas and she sent me all this stuff then she said next i'll have this clock like and that uh, i can see it now i know what she means right you ready to see the photo frame <laughs> Happiness blooms from within. Listen, yeah, I just wanted to have it like this, on this wall. The black goes with that. You know, you can kill two birds with one stone. I've got no photos and then I could have six. Did you see the vibe or is it giving live, laugh, love? Comment your honest opinions below. But do you see what I mean? Like we saw the green and we thought that needs to go in a home with a green sofa. So do I just go get loads of black photo frames? I need guidance. It's just the perfect photo spot though, isn't it, to start with? But if you do like it, it's from the range. It was 12 99 I believe. I still, I don't hate it, but it is reminding me of Live, Love, Love and it's put me off. In the range, I didn't have any bags. So they put my stuff in this. It's huge. And I also bought Christmas soap, look at him. So this is where I wanted to put it, but now I'm thinking it's not going to look nice because there's so much washing up. Moving my 5,000 bowls. Ignore the washing up, okay? You can't see it. Look how cute it's going to look there. Oh, it looks so cute. I might even get one for the bathroom. I absolutely love it. I think it may be a bit tacky, but I like it. Also, can you see? Ooh! 
air fryer it's my new favorite thing thinking of lunch what can i put in the air fryer dinner anything i can put in the air fryer and it was hashtag hashtag gifted hashtag influencer hashtag Commission, do I get commission? Oh, I don't know if I get commission, you know. But if I do, I disclose it. Don't ride back, darling. I'll say bye to Santa. I'll see you soon. See you soon. Ho, ho, ho. This is where my slow cooker lived. And it now is on the fridge, which is actually highly offensive. And I hate it being up there. I think I'm going to have to sort something out and put it in there. My boyfriend suggested putting it in the loft. And I was like, what if I need to use it? And he's like, how many times have you used it? I was like, <laughs> since I've had it, maybe four times. Five times? Six, maybe. I wanted to be a slow cooker girl and I just couldn't do it. But air fryer, quick, easy, love it. As you can see, it's a different day, but I didn't get time to show you the beloved air fryer in action. And we're going to make a recipe that I actually had saved before I even had an air fryer. Kept popping up on TikTok and I would save them because I was like, well, that's a great recipe. That's quick and easy. Because you're getting a theme here. I love quick and easy. We put on screen the air fryer that I've got. And they've basically got like a whole section... They have a whole section on their website for energy saving. And I'm pretty sure this air fryer saves like 60% energy or something like that. And we need that right now, obviously. A crisis going on in the UK. Who doesn't want to save 60% of energy right now? Exactly, exactly. Why do I need to turn on my whole oven when I've got my little air fryer? I'll link it below. 100% recommended air fryer. I don't like when something's hyped. And I avoid it. I don't want air fryer. I don't want air fryer. Because everyone's like, air fryer, air fryer, air fryer. And I got one and the hype's real. Today I'm going to show you how to make these sweet chilli cheese bites. These are so easy to make and they are honestly phenomenal. They actually look well nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mmm, so good. I'm not even bad for you. <gasps> that was hot. And it's air fried, it's air. <laughs> I want to do the pole. <sighs> ah! Okay, it's still too hot. We're still going to try though. No, it's too hot. You get the gist. Look at that. Oh, yeah. You know what? Next time I do it, instead of doing it with cornflakes and spices, I might do it with chili Doritos. Also, I forgot to add, let's just say a bit of cod takes 30 minutes in the conventional oven. Air fryer, like, what, 18, 19, 20? Speed, love it, I'm going on now, right, bye. Can we talk about Christmas now? Because it's next month. Have I got a Christmas planner? No. Have I done my Christmas saving? Yeah. I was actually gonna talk about that in August. Apart from that, I've done nothing else. I always do this, have proper momentum, forget, and then I'm like, crap, it's next month. I haven't even done a Christmas planner video. Someone said they've rewatched my old one, so actually rewatch them, because they're gonna be just as useful. I might even watch one back for some inspo. I wanna do a Christmas planning video, so how do you want that set up? How are we gonna do it this year? How are we gonna plan Christmas this year? I know YouTubers and influencers and stuff get their Christmas tree up so early. Just, I can't do that. I need to go now because I'm going to see my friend's new house. I'm actually so excited to see it. If some random person up the road said, do you want to come in and look at my house? Apart from thinking he's a serial killer or she, I would love to. Just about to get my shoes on. Got the gilet on that I showed in my last video. It was a haul if you haven't seen it. I'll put it somewhere up here. Um, and I was just looking at my bedroom and I was like, look at the sun. That's why I love having voils. I just love that with the blinds and seeing that. Talking of home updates though, still haven't changed this bloody headboard. I really want a headboard, right? Like that. Ideally like a scalloped edge, I don't know, but I just want another headboard. If you can recommend me one, that'd be absolutely fabulous. Also, still need to change these as well. Remember when I painted them and they come up brown? When you turn the light on, they look awful. You know what, I shouldn't even bother putting photo frames up. Look, look at this, my masterpiece. We did that thing where you swap. So you have a canvas and you swap it for five minutes. This is what we came up with, isn't it great? Look at that in the sunshine. Oh my God, it looks so good in the sunshine. You're probably thinking, no, it doesn't. That's a questionable dinosaur. Don't look too close at that. But look, a water Malone mountain. That was my plane. Masterpiece. If you need a fun activity to do, I highly recommend. I got these canvases from Flying Tiger. Love that shop. Am I sat on my chairs because I haven't got a sofa? Maybe. But that'll be my next vlog. This one's over. Uh, thanks for watching. Give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Ciao.